following contests for the MMA Grand Prix title. That's Leo the Bull Curtis getting his first championship one-on-one -on -one opportunity against the current reigning MMA Grand Prix champion, Gabe of the Father-Son Fist Bump, who defeated his son back on the 14th of, of December. And his son has decided not to re-challenge his dad and to go back to things as normal. So the next, champ the next challenger steps up, and that is Leo the Bull Curtis, number one contender for the MMA Grand Prix Championship getting his opportunity here on this very festive holiday edition of F4L Icons of Dream Masters and Warriors of Wrestling in the kickoff and the question to ask yourself if this is how we kick off a show what we will have later on as we wait the champion and getting his escorted to the ring as always here comes Gabe, the current reigning MMA Grand Prix champion for the F4L Icons. Being escorted to the ring by the fine gentleman here in the F4L Icon Holiday Extravaganza Arena. And there you So this is an MMA Grand Prix Championship title match, which means it is under MMA Grand Prix title rules for Astra here icons. Which means that the only way is to whomever gets the best of two, uh, the best of three, um, a best of three points in a singles match will be declared the winner. And the only way is to pick up the points is by um, pinfall, uh, sorry, by knockout or submission. So again, the only way for someone to get a fall here is by submission or knockout only. And it does take place inside of the cage, much like the MMA. This is why it's MMA Grand Prix title rules, for us anyway. And they have best of three rounds, so that's how it works. As the champion makes his way to the ring... Gabe has defended a championship before. He's been a champion before anyway. He has been the F4L Icon Dream Masters champion. After he cashed in successfully the case of fate on Tristan, which Tristan has vowed one day to get retribution for. We're going to see Gabe later on as he's going to try to get into the title picture with Robin this time. So here we go. They're going to drop the cage momentarily. For the Introducing the challenger <laughs> from Swansea, Wales. Weighing in at 225 pounds. The sportsman, Leo the Bull Curtis. So, Leo the Bull Curtis fighting out of the UK. Introducing the champion from Salt Lake City, Utah. Weighing in at 280 pounds. He is the, the American Dream, Big Daddy Gabriel. So, Gabe of the Father-Son Fist Bump defends his MMA Grand Prix Championship. And the MMA rules against Leo the Bull Curtis, who's been in preparation. And since the get-go has been involved in a lot of MMA-style matches here, both in real life and on here in Icon's world. Yeah, you see the F-World Grand Prix Championship being shown by the referee. Should be a very interesting occasion. Bowings. So again, whoever picks up the best in three rounds will be the win. The only way is to pick up the points, knockouts, and submissions. Leo the Bull Curtis likes to use those heavy-handed fists. 
Gabe, of course, wouldn't be the champion if he wasn't, he didn't have some MMA st skills. In fact, he was able to defeat his son, who's a former judo, uh, taekwondo champion, as well as Muay Thai champion. So, again, G Austin decided not to challenge his father, seeing it's, Holly to, it's, Hall, it's Christmas time, so he decided to waive his right as the, cha as the, re as the rematch. But we'll see Austin a little later on in the Holiday Blitz Melee. Should be interesting there as Leo the Bull Curtis go to the high rent district. You don't see it often. Ooh, flying fist drop. But when he does, it's effective. Leo the Bull Curtis is very heavy hand. Oh, there's a shot right there. Knocks him to a knee. I think the matter. Oh, there's the Superman punch, and that's going to be a point for Leo. Gabe has to do something here to get back into the swing of things otherwise it's going to be a quick match as Leo gets his first point and Gabe's now firing back Leo with a shot to the breadbasket now going for an arm bar this is the style that Leo trains in so Leo the Bull Curtis is not ooh nice takedown there by Gabe Gabe's got to be one step ahead and be careful of those heavy hands. Uh-oh. And now, Ga now Leo, juking and jiving, showing the fancy footwork. And the rugby slash MMA star from the mean streets of the United Kingdom taking it to the United the American Dream. One half of the father-son fist bump. I don't think the baseball helmet throwbacks to his Sandlot movie days is helping him much here as Leo oof Gabe catches him coming in Leo is with a reversal ooh shot to the knee gotta be careful here again the only ways to get a a point is by pinfall is by knockout or submission Leo's going with a fist drop drops it hard now you gotta wonder if where the helmet he's wearing a baseball bat his helmet if that fist really did much damage. Oh, Leo, wait a minute, hold on now. And Leo, nice, oof. Nice combination there. And now measuring the champion. Oof, pop up shot, and we have a new champion, and just that quick. Unbelievable knockout shot. Sometimes when you have a challenger, you can see the hunger in them. And definitely for weeks, months, we've seen the building. Unbelievable. Absolute impressive victory by the young man from the United Kingdom. Surely his hard work has definitely paid off here.